Arnold back here again with Flex MP for another WOW or Workout of the Week Wednesday. Well, yesterday we brought you a glute burner with a T-Rex. If you didn't see that, check it out. This is kind of going to go in that theme, uh, working those glutes or at least emphasizing them. And this is going to be another at home. Last week we brought you a one dumbbell, one dumbbell fits all workout. Similar theme, just different exercises, different workout format, again, with that glute focus. So for a lot of you still working out at home or limited equipment or just wanna get in and out, this is for you. All you need is one dumbbell and that is it. So very economical, especially with a lot of equipment not around. So we're gonna start here with these split squats. So you don't need even a lot of weight for this one. All you're gonna do is take that in that goblet position. If you don't have anything to elevate, this is all we're gonna do right here. And I will put those rep counts down below. Now, if you have something like a bench or chair or box, hopefully you got a chair somewhere in your house. This is all you need to do as well. With these, I see these done wrong a lot. Squeeze this back glute, it'll help open up your hip because here at Flex MP, we always wanna give you some extra mobility. What that is doing by going slow and control, we open up that hip flexor, get that stretch on that quad, and always take these slow, especially if you're not used to them. And as far as distance, people are always like, oh, I don't know where to go. First, just start with your foot like that, hop out here, but it should be close to about a 90 degree angle, okay? Make sure you do both legs. From there, we're gonna set a clock to mix things up a little bit. You're gonna just place that dumbbell on your hip. Again, if you have something elevated, like a chair or something, a couch, even work out great, put that weight here. We're just going to drive up. You can hold that weight if you need to. Make sure we're sweeping the glutes as many reps as you can into one minute. So that can take a light weight, from what we just did, that exercise and this, really get a great glute workout. Okay, still working those glutes, but now we go into isometrics. One dumbbell, one leg. So press both up and then you're just going to lift and extend. Squeezing this quad, this is up. So same arm, same leg, whoo! We're also getting those obliques to help stabilize out, pressing that dumbbell up. Single arm, single leg presses, again, make sure you do both sides. From here, we're gonna stand up. We're gonna take a traditional bent over row and we're gonna add a drop catch. I'll explain why after I demonstrate. So proper hinge over, straight back, but you're gonna row with control, let it go out of the hand and catch it. One, that's great reactional timing, so if you're an athlete. But if you're just a weekend warrior, just looking for a good workout, why would you wanna do this? For well, one, you got a brace, so your core is gonna be engaged. Who doesn't wanna work more abs? Plus, you're gonna fire up some more muscle fibers there in the back. And as you can tell from my breath, it definitely gets your heart rate up there because you have to focus a little bit more. So your body's got to work a little bit more and more muscle fibers acting. So we got one more on this circuit, but we do have a finisher today. So we'll have you, we'll check, check that one out. From here, we add a little bit more power. So we're going with that diagonal lunge to a clean knee drive. So some stability training, show you on the other arm. So you're going to hit that diagonal lunge, make sure we're sitting back in that glute. From here, we're gonna add that power drive up, clean it up, and then we add some added stability. Whew. And then after you finish that, again, doing about three to five rounds of that little circuit, you're gonna finish off, you're gonna set two minutes on the clock for a fun little full body finisher, alternating snatches. Watch out, Jay. So this is all you're gonna do from here to the sky. A little bit easier with the dumbbell, you keep that close, quick and just alternate. So we're getting the glutes, the quads, the core, the back and the shoulders, as many reps as you can. Set a goal in your head. If you can do anywhere from 50 reps in two minutes, that'd be a pretty impressive thing. Let me know if you end up doing this workout, comment below, how many reps did you get in on that last part? How'd you do? What weight did you use? Let's get some feedback on how you were feeling because we're getting a lot of love there on YouTube. I want to hear on some of these other channels as well. There's your workout. Again, more programming notes below. Now, if you like stuff like this or want some personalized stuff for you while you're at home, still making those gains, making those goals, creating a customized roadmap for you, click on that link below. Let's set up that free appointment today. Get you moving better, living better, and feeling better. Moving Don't into 2021. Don't give up. Try your best. Good. Have fun and stay strong. Yes. And have an awesome day. Take care.